What is going on everyone and welcome back to more Black Desert. So today is the first day season started. I don't really know too much about it. I kind of heard a little bit, but I don't know uh, really what to expect. Uh, I actually made a character for the seasons and we're going to play it a little bit later in this video. Um, but before that, I just logged in like 10 minutes ago, checking everything. So... Apparently, we got some rewards for all this stuff. I don't... I kind of wish, or like, I hate when the games keep adding different currencies to stack up. And, like, it just gets complicated for the newer players. Like, for us, it's fine. Like, we know what to do, what, like, enhancing material is used for what. But they keep adding new currencies in the game, like, or enhancing materials. That just makes the game more confusing. And like this this like well, what do these even do half of the time but yeah let me uh collect these real quick um let me just check to see what's the ones we should get pre-creation rewards uh hopefully all of you guys got yours as well tuvala or Time filled black stones. 500 you exchange for advice of Valx 40. Well, no, to be honest. Accept these rewards before July 17th, so that's one month. Okay. We got a free hundred mil and a Papu emote. That's cool, I guess. That was kind of surprising. I mean, I'll take a free hundred mil. Alright, anyway, um... Let us go into our season character. You cannot switch to a, wait what? That has a level of six or you can't switch to a character level six or lower. Why? Oh my goodness. Why is that even an option or like the thing? All right, whatever. We'll do it from the main menu like they intended us to do it. But yeah, I don't really know too much about the whole season thing, except I heard that it's mostly just a grind, and they just want to like catch up the newer and like mid-tier players up to speed. So it's like enjoy your XP bonuses. Here's some new goodies that we don't know about. Why does it start you at half health with no potions or anything? Oh goody. You know what's weird? One thing I don't know they really thought of, and I don't know what they would have done either, is for all of us who have, well, for all of us who have uh, Old Moon and Comma books up, it's kind of an advantage already. All right, um, this is like playing a new character again. Talk to Eden. We're just gonna kind of blow past all of these quests, or I'm not gonna really uh, bother reading them. I just wanna get to level 10, and then we could possibly buy the season pass. Oh. Um, but yeah, I wonder what they're going to do. If they plan on doing seasons every, like, every three months or so, I wonder what we're going to do with all the extra characters we have, because, uh, the only character I don't have right now is a wizard, because I'm dumb and decided to make two Dark Knights for some reason back in the day.
I actually have no idea how to play a guardian, so I heard it's like if you play uh, <laughs> Awakening, basically grab Shift Q and then things just die if you have enough AP. <laughs> It's been a while. I don't actually know where I'm going, like, half the time. But, you know, it's always interesting because I get to see what it's like for a new player. And see what the experience is all over again. Which might be entertaining to you, like an experienced veteran player starting over from the beginning. So, that's pretty cool, I guess. But yeah, next season, if we decide to play it, I'll probably make a wizard just to have it. And or another Dark Knight, because that's really the only character I know how to play to an, like at a high level. Defeat small tree spirits. Defeat the packs of gray wolves. Where do you get the Tuvala weapons? I know everyone has them. I just don't know where to get them. But we're definitely going to be doing a lot of enhancing on that one. God, if only leveling up here was that e or like at 62 to 63 was this easy. Hey, dude's playing Guardian too. He knows what's up. I feel like I should be playing on a season server. God, that's so bad. I think the season server just gives you more XP. It's kind of like Arsha or something, except no PvP. Not that I'd be against it, but it's just... I don't really know. All right, what does season server give? I think it's just more XP on season servers. Down F. Right mouse button. Up F. God, there's so many people.
think I made a mistake by choosing the season server. Wait, so on season, do you get to use like all the money and stuff you had previously, or is it a different story? What does this mean? Oh, you can use these in season if it has the icon. Some dude just got a pen Tuvala. What the heck? Do I have to use this on uh, season? Because I would, you know, rather not do that if possible. I don't know how long I'm going to be playing this season. Are people croning? Oh no. Look at all these people. If I were to guess, I think that good starter classes, if you were to like play this uh, as an actual new player, I think ones like Wizard, Witch are pretty good choices. Um, honestly, all of them are good. It's more like which ones would be the easiest, I'd say. Wizard, Witch. Things are big AoEs. Yeah, okay, so after 15 minutes, we are out of this. Oh. Do we just get a two hour? Ooh, XP. But my goal pretty much is probably just going to be do the dailies, buy the season. I wonder if people are selling them. I would think there's a lot of them, but apparently not. Oh! All right. Time to give PA money and buy this dumb spirit pass. Only seizing characters may use the spirit pass. Level 15 aid box. All right, let's actually, uh... dude, if it's gonna keep flashing like that, I mean, it's cool, but. Let me see what the rewards actually are. Inventory, are these season specific? Oh, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Elian's Tears. This is worth level 20. The 
seizing character will be automatically transferred to a normal server. If the character completes certain challenges during the season, once a certain pen kaposha earring or pen kaposha ring. I think the Kaposha ring is worth. It's the same as like a Tet Crescent. I'm not sure about the Kaposha earring. Like at this point, for me personally, an upgrade would be Black Distortions. All right, so let's see. Uh, now that we have the Spirit Pass. Questionable worth. I mean, you can only use it on season, so whatever, we're gonna get it. Elian's Tear, Blessing, and Kama Sylvia. Good. The pass pretty much made up for itself with that outfit box, like the amount of money or, you know, just having it, Kron's worth. Um, seven day blessing, worth, irrelevant, level 40, there's no level 30? Alright, whatever, well, artisans and doggo, worth, 20 stack, good. Secret old moon book, good. 40 stacks, nice. They give you... They give you Perfume of Courage, 20? That's a lot of money, even though I actually just use them for grinding. 100 mil if you defeat 100 Bashams. Con uh... Maid and a... a Assume like a three day explorer compass. Shikatu boxes, Tuvala or Equip a Tuvala ring. More maids. Equip a Pry Tuvala, sixty one. Where's the otter emote? Eighty stack, fifty stack. I could reach sixty one. That seems easy. Can you sit on an Target dummy AFK and get 61 because I could leave my computer on. He used the Oasis food. stack with uh
Shift. Oh. Imagine playing a 300 AP Guardian in right now. Like, I actually seen it. Like, Zethian, the streamer, dude, he's like beyond geared, and I love watching him. He's a cool dude. And just him and RBF, he presses like one button and deletes like seven people. It's pretty amazing. Shift F, Shift Q, Up Q. Man, that's such a weird combo. Up and Q. Huh. Nice, level 15. Can you use this thingy now? That right there, like just any class with big AoEs is more valuable. Okay. this garbage out of my inventory. Are we, I don't think we're allowed to, but are we, um. Allowed to use horses from previous characters? I don't think so, but. Talk to Tiny Nose at Imp Cave. Got, okay, hold on. Let me just follow the auto path. Eventually, I would like to get 30,000 quests. Take a look at the cave wall. Talk to Uno near the imp cave entrance to learn more about Red Nose. I really don't understand why, like, we're allowed to use mono stuff on season characters, but they don't really incentivize life skilling on season. Doesn't really make sense to me, but whatever. Oh god. Yeah, I. Dude. I can't. There's too many people too early on day one. It's using servers. I don't care if it gives 100% more XP. I want to be able to clear stuff.
Yeah, we just don't get the 100% XP bonus. Like, who cares, though? Being able to complete a quest in a normal time is pretty nice. How to play Guardian. Shift F. Shift Q. Oh my god, dude, let me lock evasion. Acquires level 21 or higher. Okay. Glad season uh, quest count. Towards um a good thirty thousand, I guess. Careful, you might be killed. All right, game, amaze me. Talk to Cliff, who just arrived, conveniently after you killed the boss.
Go to Logia Farm. Uh, once we get to Velia, though, I did want to figure out how these two Vala things work. Exchange one for what gear? What are these? Two Vala or 400? Stones required for try, 30. What? Why? Why do they have to add stupid things like that? Why can't it just be one for one attempt? The usual. It's things like that that's just so confusing for people. Stones required. Same with the Manos accessories. Just like, just use one. Make it less common, but... Use one. It makes things so much simpler. Go to Velia Coast. I'm gonna just yeet myself off this cliff real quick. Oh, wait, never mind. Next cliff. We get to yeet ourselves off. I want to enhance Tuvala gear. The storage keeper and blacksmith dude. Skill instructor. Meet Eileen again. Okay. Um, I want to figure this out. Blacksmith dude. Oh god. Oh no. Tuvala main hand. Sub weapon. Get this garbage out of my inventory. Okay, so. <laughs> this is gonna be stupid. This item can be used to enhance Tuvala gear. You can also exchange it for goodies. No. 
None of these really seem worth the 500 for 40 stack. Those are some weird percentages. Oh, they use normal stacks too. But it costs a lot too. I see. What the heck? How many do I exchange? Chibala or one? I think I'll take all of that. Take one of these. Interesting. Not be enhanced. Garbage. Okay. Hundred and six AP. Curious to know what the percentages of uh, hands up accessories are. You can cron these. actually don't have enough um can i enhance these on another character this item cannot be enhanced or cap for stones you can use can i put these in storage though I'm gonna hold on to that for now. Okay, um I don't know. It's a lot of questionable life decisions. I do want to get a pen, but I hope the percentage to hit a pen, like of these season items, is like more than 3%.
Dude, that's like failing a Ted accessory on 110 like seven times. That's like the feeling. That's a yikes. We got to plus 14 in 80 durability. I mean, which is good normally for boss gear, but for the ones that requires like a stupid amount of stones to get. Ten of these equals one Tuvala or. Dear God, dude, I can't say I really ever want to spend artisans on this. Oh, rip. I'm stupid. I bought them on the other character. Uh, rip. Okay, well, that's fine. Luckily, that's only three stones. It's not a big deal. Um, anyway, hold on. Let me go. Twenty-four stack on that character. All right. Um, I don't really know what I want to do, to be honest. Hundred and nineteen AP. All right, cool. Whatever. We'll hold on to that. I'm gonna split my recording here, and I'll see you guys in a minute. 